Hey everybody. Well, oh, that looks a little blurry. Yeah, cool. There. Okay. Welcome everyone. Okay, we've got the webinar on my laptop over here. So I'm just gonna lean over and get that recording started and then we'll get started. Okay, let's see where is it? Will you push the periscope back a little bit for me then? What? Push it back? No, no, that's fine. That's okay. Fine. All right. Record. Hey everyone, it is August 14th, Friday, Can't 2015. That I know. Crazy. <laughs> it's the summer already over. I mean, my daughter just started school. Hey, so we've got a, this is our first kind of scopinar, as I'm going to call it. We've got a webinar going on my laptop over here, and we have Periscope going at the same time. Periscope is on Lindsay's account, H Made Mommy. Yes. And just in case you're wondering. Yes. I have an account, H Made Daddy, but we're doing it on H Made Mommy. If you guys want to watch it there and be able to okay. interact as well. So hopefully everyone on the webinar can see us. Can you guys see us? Me waving, just comment if you can and that you guys can also hear us. So, um, Great, so let me introduce and do the housekeeping for the Periscope and then we'll get started with the class. So we've got everyone coming in. Please type where you're watching from. If you are liking what you're hearing, if you're new to Periscope, please tap, tap, tap on the screen and you'll see these beautiful colored hearts floating up for everyone to see. And if you would also click on the little man with the numbers, you will see my profile pop up in a word that says share and you can share this with your followers and you can also um, tweet it on Twitter and that's going to be a good tip for later as well. Can you, can on Periscope, can you guys hear me talk? I know you can hear Lindsay, what we were telling everybody on the webinar, my microphone goes to the webinar, okay, everyone says yes. Yes, okay, great. Go to Paris. okay, awesome. great. Awesome, we got two cool. really good mics here, so thank you so much for your patience. I'm gonna grab my oils here that I showed you so beautifully in the beginning. And hopefully our lighting stays good here. It looks a lot better on Periscope than it does on the webinar, but anyway. You wanna one drop? Um, yes, okay. We've got Stress Away Diffusing, but I need to put some on, <laughs> because this is pretty awesome. And it's a first time for everything, right? I'm take a drop too. Okay. Thank you. All right. Now I'm feeling. All right. Now I'm feeling like I'm ready. One drop is all it takes to change your life. So again, my name is Lindsay Gramont, the homemade mommy. And I am Evan Gramont, the homemade daddy. I'm so excited to have you with me here tonight. So you probably recognize my blog. I blog over at um, www.homemademommy.net and I'm also the founder of The Oily Angels and you can check us out at theoilyangels.com. I do what I love, so what is that? My passion is serving a community of individuals who care about what they put in and on their bodies, who seek to thrive and not just survive, who want to be vibrantly healthy and well, who are, own, who are their own health advocates and don't take anything they hear or read at face value, but who seek to learn by listening to their body and their family's bodies and feeding it what it needs to be healthy and strong. We support this community on its path to optimal wellness by encouraging busy moms and dads to cook healthy and unprocessed foods for their families and to get rid of toxins in their homes via easy homemade beauty and cleaning recipes. We've been with Young Living now for about two years at the time of this broadcast and didn't have any earthly idea when we started that we would be here hosting a class on two different mediums <laughs> for hundreds of people. It's crazy. So um, what an awesome blessing. When I first started, um, you know, Evan is now with me, but when I first started, I really had no idea what to do with my oils. And it took me a little while, but I buckled down and I started reading. I read the resources that were given to me and that I had at my fingertips, and I learned, and I learned yeah. by doing. So this class today is going to help you start on your path, but it's just the beginning of many more opportunities to learn. So we, we want to make sure that you guys know we try and keep everything very relaxed, yes. right? It, it's just sharing, Plus right? we're stress-free now. Yeah, we now, just we're, been on now we're very relaxed. Um, <laughs> But the way we do it is 
we use a script. There's a lot to cover, and it can be very easy for those of you on Periscope, know this term, it can be very easy to squirrel, meaning to sort of sidetrack and get all over the place, but it's too important. So we like to use a script. You will see the script in our hands at all times. We will read from the script, um, but we think that is a great way, tactical way to get through your class, to get all the information out, and then anything else, you know, you can do it afterwards, but we like to follow the script. And we want you to also know that you have this tool at your fingertips. I mean, I wrote this script, so I know what's in it, but it keeps me on track and it will keep you on track too. Yeah. Um, so I just want to point out that um, if, you, if the broadcast is too full for you guys to comment, that you can tweet me at HMadeMommy. So you can click share and then share on Twitter, and you can delete all the text and then just comment on Twitter, and we'll be able to check it out after the broadcast and reply to any of your questions. So are you here tonight because you want to get toxic chemicals out of your family's home? Are you here to improve your mood or support your immune system? Are you here to learn how to make some of your own natural beauty and cleaning products? Well, let's get this out of the way, okay? Very important. Sorry. <laughs> hey, this is, this, is, this, is, this is all new. We are not medical professionals. We cannot treat, diagnose, or cure you. No. Um, so in please, the in the Periscope, please don't comment with any of your medical conditions because that is not compliant and we don't, when we, everybody we're, we're in here doesn't answer. need, doesn't need to know about those. Yeah, and we're going to ask that people on Periscope don't answer as well. Thank you. Um, this is an FDA compliant class. This script is an FDA compliant script and no one in the room again may discuss, um, any abnormal state of the body or any disease state. We are here to help you learn what essential oils are and how you can incorporate them into your life to support various body systems and to make products in ways you may never have expected. Super fast, super easy, and super effective. Whatever the reason, we have a very enriching class. What? Um, <laughs> this doesn't look good. I think we lost the webinar. We may have lost the webinar. Hold on. Let's see here. Keep going, Ev. It's okay. okay. Um, we've got an enriching class planned, and we have a lot to pack into it. So we, we do want to get right to it after we reconnect. I don't know what that means. But uh, can you guys, is anyone in the webinar right now that's watching on Periscope, can you guys still see it? Because we got an error message that said the webinar froze. Oh, no. Let me reconnect okay. it. We're okay. going to try and reconnect. Let's see here. Okay. This is all part of it. We just go with the flow here, right? Yeah. Okay, so I know all of you guys on the Periscope are still here, but I got to reconnect the webinar. So uh, hold on. Let me see if we, I don't know, it's thinking thinking and it's moving very slowly. I don't know why. Leaving webinar. Okay, well we should keep going. Okay. So we're going to keep going and the webinar, we'll just have to wait a second. Something's wrong with my computer, but you know, you go with the flow. Yeah, that's just the way it is. Okay, so can you, can you read this part so I can fix sure. this? Okay. Excuse me for one second, folks. All right. So, should we switch? No, go ahead. Just okay. So what are Young Living Essential Oils? Um, for us, we know that nature has provided us with everything we need to survive and thrive on this earth. The plants used for essential oils have been around longer than we have, and humans have been using nature's abundance in many ways, from the obvious uses like food and even shelter, to less known ways, including distillation into essential oils for various powerful applications. For us, these are truly some of God's greatest gifts. Oh, give me yeah. a mic. They can't hear me. Oh, okay. All right, I'm back. Can you hear me now? Okay. 
Okay, this should be better. Okay, good. So what I was saying is that for us, we know that these oils, these essential oils, are very powerful ways. Um, they're very powerful tools that God has given us from earth, and that's important for us. Um, they're highly concentrated, aromatic essences of trees, shrubs, herbs, grasses, resins, and flowers. Essential oils are greaseless and not like other oils you have in your home, like olive oil or coconut oil, for example, which was a big thing for me because I do not like greasy oils. That was a big issue for me, and they are not greasy. So they, they uh, are the exact opposite of that, and that's, that was a big thing for me, and I really love them for that. Um, essential oils are the plant's natural defense and protective mechanisms. They work the same way in our bodies, as they do in nature, they penetrate cell membranes and dispense into our blood and tissues. One drop contains countless molecules that affect the body at the cellular level. Their purpose is to help support all of our body systems by keeping our bodies clean and our system functioning as it should. On average, each essential oil contains hundreds of molecular constituents with more being discovered every day. The, the key to producing therapeutic-grade essential oils, however, is to preserve as many of these delicate compounds as possible, because even the smallest compounds play an important role in arriving at the final result. Just like a symphony, the quality of the music is dependent on each individual instrument coming together harmoniously. So any impurity or any out-of-tune instrument has a dramatic effect on the final result. Let's be very clear. Not all oils are created equal. Okay, we should be back up in the, the webinar. Sorry, guys. So Young Living is the oldest, most trusted, and well-respected essential oil company in the world. And with 25 years plus, I mean, of research and hands-on experience, we are the only essential oil company with our own farms offering a seed-to-seal guarantee. And if you're curious about that, you need to go to www.seedtoseal.com. So I personally advocate knowing my farmer and live that philosophy daily. We source all of our food locally from local farmers, and I have been to, we have been to, Evan's been to two of the farms, right. and I've been to four of the Young Living Farms, and I know my image is blocked in the webinar. I don't know, I even know okay. what that means. Well, the words are more important at this point. Yeah. The, the name of it, again, is seed to to seal. Seal. Dot com. Dot com. Somebody wants to throw it up there. Yes, thank you very much. So we have both been to many of our farms, and we have met and spent time on the farms with our founder, Gary Young, and can tell you firsthand that we actually participated at Winter Harvest. We cut down trees. We put them through the chipper. We put them into the distillery, I mean, into the cooker, and then distilled the oils and ourselves watched, and watched, watched the, the oil, oil come out. Down. There was no nothing added, not, nothing to adulterate it or anything like that. So, I mean, we know where our oils come from, and we know the farms. So Pure. Pure, yeah, exactly. <laughs> so the key to our seed to seal is ensuring that all of those quality controls are in place so that you're receiving the essential oils exactly the way nature intended, with all of the, the right molecular components intact. And it, it's really important to know that we spend a lot of time figuring out how plants like to be distilled, and that that is a critical part of the process and what is going to yield the best result. So if you ever want to visit Young Living Farm, we definitely encourage you to do so. We need plenty of people because we do this thing where you pick weeds by hand instead of spraying them, and they need a lot of help doing that. So hopefully you all will get to go there someday um, in the not-so-distant future, whether you're going for some kind of a leadership retreat with Young Living or you just go for a replanting or a, a lavender days or something like that in Mona, Utah or other areas. So we have farms all over the world. I've been to, Evan and I both went to our Ecuador farm, and I have been to the Mona, Utah farm. Evan and I have both been to the Highland Flats farm in Idaho, and I've also been to the St. Mary's Farm in Idaho. So pretty, pretty darn neat. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. It's really, really cool. It's, it's, pretty, um, it's an amazing experience to actually see it in process 
hands-on. I mean, you get to meet the people that are working at the farm. Um, it's just it's awesome. It's awesome. It really so, is incredible. I'd love to know in the scope if any of y'all have ever been to any farms and list which one you've been to because I'd, I'd love to see that. All right. So if you haven't started taking notes yet, I want you guys to go and get a piece of paper and a pen or get out your Evernote or something like that to take your notes with. I hope the uh, webinar is working. I don't really know. <laughs> so if you guys are on the webinar, tell me if it's working, with scoper people. Um, so we're going to talk now about how to use Young Living essential oils. We can use Young Living oils in three ways, topically, aromatically, internally as a dietary supplement. The FDA has labeling laws for dietary supplements and cosmetics. So the FDA prefers to see these as separate labels. The FDA asked Young Living to choose the primary usage that most people use an essential oil for, and that is what Young Living has indicated on the label. Since our essential oils have been traditionally used in all three ways, and due to the high quality of our essential oils, to keep it simple, just start with the primary usage that Young Living had to select um, that's on the label, and then go from there as you see fit for your family. I hope that makes sense to everyone watching. The first is topically, so I'm going to dive in deep to all three of these, also known as transdermal. So you saw me apply the stress away a little while ago. Essential oils are rapidly absorbed into our skin, which is not surprising considering our skin is the largest organ of the body. We apply the oils to various points on our bodies, on our feet. Oh, excuse you. Um, Sorry, we had a troll there. <laughs> you can apply them to the bottom of your feet, um, to, to really anywhere on your body that you prefer. Applying the oils to our feet is a great place to put them because it absorbs really quickly and our feet are pretty tough and you know, you're not going to feel if an oil is exciting your skin or anything like that. You can also bathe in the essential oils. Um, it's best to mix about 15 to 20 drops with Epsom salt. Um, in a separate bowl or a jar and I shake it up and then dump it into the bath because oil and water don't mix and so you don't want to just dribble oils onto the top of the bath water because then when you get in the water they're going to kind of pool around your skin and might not feel so great. So you want to mix it in with the Epsom salt to, um, to disperse it in, you know, into the water properly. The second way is inhalation and I just want to ask y'all, what memory does the smell of freshly baked chocolate chip cookies evoke to you? So I want to hear what you guys think on the Periscope. Webinar folks, you can think about it and uh, type it in wherever you are. Scents are really powerful, and the best and fastest way to reach our mood center is through our nose. In less than a second, essential oils hit the limbic system and have the power to affect our mood. How cool is that? When you walk into a room and you smell something that is calming to you, you're gonna notice your calm before you figure out what the smell is. Okay, we have to block some more people here. So 75% of American homes though use synthetic air fresheners that contain numerous amounts of chemical agents that have been linked to cancer, namely formaldehyde. When you see the term fragrance on any product, whether it be an air freshener or even your face lotion, you need to remember that that one word can contain 300 toxic chemicals. They don't need to disclose all of them. They just kind of lump them all into one bucket and they can just say fragrance. So I want you to go and take a look at all of your products in your bathroom and your candles and everything else and know that that fragrance word can be 300 toxic chemicals. Formaldehyde is a number one cancer-causing chemical and is what you're embalmed with at the morgue. It's disgusting. So really don't do that. We can diffuse instead. So we've got our diffuser going right here. It's a cool mist diffuser and it's not putting out hot air. It's not a humidifier. Um, it's just putting the lovely oils into the air for us to enjoy. You can also do what's called tinting. I know it's really yucky, right? You can also do what's called tinting where you get a bowl and you fill it with boiling hot water and as soon as you put it in the bowl it's not going to be boiling anymore because 
it's not on the heat source anymore. And you're gonna add just a couple of drops of essential oil, a little goes a very long way. And then cover your head with a towel and you can breathe in the vapors and it's really, really amazing. Great for emotional support, great for just helping to clear whatever you need to clear at that moment. So have any of you guys ever did tinting, ever done tinting before <laughs> that I just explained? I'd love to hear. Um, the third way is ingesting our oils. You can get the benefits from ingesting essential oils as a dietary supplement. We have many that are labeled that way and many that aren't, but as I said before, it's because the FDA prefers seeing one label versus another. You can put them in a, let me grab this here, a vegetable capsule. Let me show that to those in the webinar too. You can put them in an empty veg vegetable capsule, open it right up and just drop the oils in and then just take them as a supplement. So there are many oils that I do like that daily. And because our oils are 100% pure with no synthetics, um, you know, using only the best seeds and plants available, Young Living oils are safe to ingest. And if you follow the French model of essential oils, that is how it's always traditionally been done, even way before, way before Young Living. So you can also um, ingest oils by adding them to your water or to a cup of tea. Um, I like to just make my own tea by heating up um, some water, putting a little honey in there, and then adding like a drop of lemon or a drop of peppermint or a drop of thieves. It's so delicious. I don't even need yeah. a tea bag. In fact, in, in one of the men's groups online today, one of the um, husbands yes. of an oily angel said that his son always steals his water because he puts lime, uh, like a, uh, I think in like a drop, drop of, of lime. lime in his water, and his son is always stealing his water, and he, you know, he likes it better than his yeah, plain he water. Yeah, he it better than his plain <laughs> water. So the husband was asking, who else does it happen to? And everyone was, you know, kind of commenting. And then we just got into, everybody just got into what's their favorite citrus oil to put into the water. Yeah, what I'm going to really ask funny. the scopers what your favorite citrus oil is. So type that in. <clears throat> You can also cook with the oils. They're amazing in your food. So, you know, just refer to your labels. Um, but peppermint and chocolate go well together. We're going to talk about a recipe for that a little bit later. And, you know, lemon and muffins, um, unbelievable ways to use the oils in cooking. If you are going to use something like a basil or oregano to flavor a pasta sauce, just know that a little goes a very long way and you want to dip a toothpick into your bottle of oregano and just swirl it into the pasta sauce and it will flavor the entire pot. So you, you do not need a whole drop even to, to flavor some of your foods. So let's talk safety. Um, you can put these oils in every orifice in your body except for two places. And I want to hear from you guys on... <laughs> I don't know if I want to hear. <laughs> on, yeah, actually, no. If, if you know the answer, put the answer in except for two places in your body. Um, if, you, if you're not sure of the answer, maybe don't put the answer in there. Yeah, nothing right, inappropriate. We, okay, we're getting some, some good answers. <laughs> Thank goodness. Okay. That's right. So the two places that you can't put the oils are in your eyes and in your ears, right? You never want to um, get the essential oils directly in your eyes or inside your ear. So. Okay. Care should be taken to dilute oils that are hot to the skin. So there are particular oils that are sort of hot to the skin when you put them on, you can feel... Um, Warm, how excited skin, yeah. Yeah, they're, you can feel them. Well, I um, just want to make the point that everybody is different. And some people, you know, I can put some oils on my skin, on my forearm here, that are hot to some people and are not to me. So um, everybody's different, and you you might think peppermint is hot. Someone's commenting with that, and I might not. So you want to test it out on your body and dilute as you feel appropriate. It is everyone's choice and, and decision on how much to dilute depending on how oils feel on their skin. And, and you know your body best. So, right. So it's best to test it out on a part of your body that you know is not sensitive. Right. Um, and then just kind of go from there. Right. And the same thing with your kids. I think that putting it on yourself first just to see what it feels like on you and then putting it on your children and diluting it on them. The, 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 the thing that you guys need to realize so you don't ever feel scared about any putting any oils on your body, because there are a lot of things I'm scared of in this world, GMOs, 
nasty food um, formaldehyde but my oils are not one of them so I'm not somebody who's scared of my oils um, but if you ever get an oil on your skin and it feels hot all you have to do is put some olive oil or coconut oil or butter or anything on it and it will cool it right away so even if your kids like ah my back is hot my back is hot um you can put some oils that, on right segue. away and it will be fine it's a good segue mm -hmm. to our next topic which is what is a carrier oil right so a carrier oil is a fatty oil such as coconut oil or avocado oil um, you want to look for a cold pressed and organic in your health food store young living also sells a nice blend in a convenient pump called a v6 oil we use carrier oils, as Lindsay said, to dilute our essential oils and make them easier to spread. So you can also, if you've got a large area that you want to use your essential oils on. Like your back. Like your back or, you know, <laughs> your thigh, just a bigger area on your body. Um, you can dilute it with the carrier oil and then you can use that oil over a larger part of your body. Um, it, diluting doesn't mean you're reducing the effectiveness. It can, and it can also make it last longer by a time release. Yep. So those are some benefits to carrier oils and diluting. Um, yeah. Right there. yeah. Okay. So who here is thinking, well, there are a lot of oils I've heard about all over the Internet. Where do I start? So what we're going to share with you today is our brand new premium starter kit. It just came out about a month and a half ago. And, the, you know, you have your basics in the kitchen. The webinar has your computer screen in front of your face. Really? Hmm. Well. Hmm. Um, doesn't look like it that to us, but yeah. okay. So you have your basics in your kitchen. You've got your salt, your pepper, your butter, all those spices that you go for. These are the most common basic ingredients that you likely reach most often for in your kitchen. And it's the same with essential oils. So what we're going to take you through are what we call our most used, most often oils, and that's why Young Living picked them to be in the starter kit. They're going to cover a broad spectrum of things to use them for. So they're going to um, empower you to rid your home of toxic chemicals, make some beauty and cleaning products, ensure your body systems are supported optimally. And these 11 oils that we're about to go through come in the premium starter kit as well as a diffuser to use the ones that you want to put in the diffuser. So we can't pass these around to you. So this is going to be like, we wish it was smell o vision <laughs> But we are going to point them out and talk to you about them. And we're going to show you some fun things to make with them. So here we go. Here's 10 of them. And here's the, the bonus one. So we're going to talk about all these now. So the first one I want to talk about is lavender. I absolutely love lavender. Um, it is called the Swiss Army Oh, yeah, knife. and someone's commenting below, and I just want to make this point, too, that currently the premium starter kit is $10 off for new members to start through the end of this month. Yay! That's awesome. So somebody has three friends, and they're passing the oils around as we speak. Yay! That's great. So and how many of y'all, that's a good point. The, those watching in the Periscope, please comment if you are watching this with friends right now and you are sharing oils with them, because that's awesome. That is just awesome. I mean, that's perfect. Love. Yeah. Smell your Love lavender. Lavender. Um, lavender is one of history's most celebrated and versatile essential oils. Um, it's also one of the safest essential oils and can be applied undiluted to the skin. Um, you can diffuse it for a comforting and calming scent. You can unwind by adding a few drops to a nighttime bath. And really what you want to do with that is you want to add your Epsom salts. You want to add it to your Epsom salts and then put it in the bath. You, you never want to put essential oils directly into the water um, because they will not absorb into the water. So you always want to use something like an Epsom salt to get it in there. You can diffuse for a fresh clean scent and to eliminate odors. Mm -mm. And then you can also complement some of your favorite shampoos, lotions, or skincare products. So um, some example recipes, linen spray, mm -hmm. body butter, you know, sort of like a sleepy time roll on and then the bath salts, which I talked about. I put on lavender. I put on um, a few drops of lavender depending on the, the night. Every night I'm using lavender every single night. So I absolutely love it. And it's a staple for my nighttime routine. Awesome. I, I don't know if you all can see the the screen or not. Maybe you're just looking at my web browser. I don't yeah. know, but we're... Um, oh, and so I'm our glad y'all can hear. Yeah, we're glad you can hear. Really, it's more about um, 
I guess, the hearing than anything. If you can't see, you're going to get a lot from listening as well. Our favorite diffusing combo for lavender, lavenders, refresh and renew. It's lavender and frankincense. Mm-hmm. That's a nice one. And the best part about, I mean, really one of the best parts about the script is that you can, you can personalize it, right? So if your favorite diffusing combo with lavender is not lavender and frankincense, then put what, what your favorite is. And then, you know, people can ask you why, and you can, you can talk about it. And, you know, it's, it's, it's really Real so Real men use essential oils, exactly. That's right. Okay, so next up is peppermint. So you guys can, can smell that, and no, I'm just kidding. Um, that smells so fresh, and it's really potent. One drop goes a long way with peppermint. It has the effectiveness of 26 cups of pure peppermint tea. So if you put a drop of this in your tea, you are going to feel a lot of opening up. It's unbelievable. Peppermint is super amazing for the digestive system. It supports everything going on in your stomach, your bowels, everything. Um, so it enhances a healthy gut function. Um, I, I love to put a drop on my tongue um, when we're out and about, and I've been looking at my phone too much um, in the car <laughs> while he's driving, which I shouldn't do. I should really not look at my phone while we're driving. While you're driving. I'm not while I'm driving. Um, but it does support no normal digestion. And it also is really great to take a big whiff of peppermint or um, put a drop in your Ninja Red before you go to work out because it does enhance uh, performance during exercise. So that's peppermint. Um, I make the most amazing... What? Oh, no. Somebody had asked a question that wasn't FDA compliant and somebody else said... Oh, Oh, okay. Can't, can't talk about that. I missed that. I'm glad. Okay. Um, so I make the most amazing peppermint chocolate truffles, and you can find the recipe on my blog. Just type in homemade mommy and ch peppermint chocolate truffles into Google, and you'll be able to find that recipe. Super easy, amazing, real food, uh, so gluten-free, grain-free. So um, they're just these little balls that you can – I just keep them in the freezer, and, you know, Evan eats them all, <laughs> basically. So, so, so peppermint and chocolate yeah. go really well together, and you guys need to go and check that one out. They're, who's tried them? I'd love to hear yeah, who's yeah, tried yeah. them. I would love to hear who's made those. Um, oh, they're so good. They're so good, yeah. So yummy peppermint chocolate truffles. So next up is lemon. Okay, so lemon. Young Living's lemon oil is cold-pressed from the rind of the lemon, not from the pulpy, acidic juice. Mm, love. Um, as <laughs> yeah. you know, the vitamins and nutrients are in the rind itself. So that is a very important distinction to make. Um, make sure when adding lemon EO to your water that you do this in a glass or stainless bottle or cup. Very important. If you use a styrofoam cup or plastic cup, you will end up with water in your lap <laughs> because the lemon will eat it up. It will it will eat up the styrofoam or the plastic. So and that's very, what it, very that's important. what it's doing in our body. It's cleaning out our cells. Exactly. Nice and scrubby. But don't worry, as Lindsay said, it's scrubbing us. So just be careful. You know, put in a glass cup, put in a steel cup. Okay. Um, but not styrofoam. Um, Primary benefits include the naturally occurring constituent limonene, enhances the flavor of foods and water, and it is a key ingredient in thieves and ninja red. Awesome. Um, so there's a lot of um, recipes. Obviously, lemon is very great for cleaning. Um, so I'm sure you guys have used it for that as well. Next up is frankincense. Okay, so frankincense is one of, I mean, where have you all heard of frankincense? Come on now. Here's frankincense. A scrubby, yes. So frankincense is amazing. I had someone tell me the other day that they thought it smelled like God's cologne which I think is so fitting because we hear about it from the Bible many, many times. Frankincense was highly valuable and sought after in ancient times. It was more valued than gold. And the only the people who had great wealth and abundance possessed it. It's really amazing for the skin. I'd love to hear what you guys think about frankincense. Keep it compliant. Um, we diffuse, you know, during meditation or prayer. Um, it gives you a lot of grounding and purpose. It's also amazing. I'm just going to give you all a little tip to do right now with your frankincense. If you have some, if you don't have some yet, you've got to try this. Um, I just put a drop of frankincense and a drop of carrier oil, and I rub it on my shoulders and my neck before bed. Oh, my gosh. It's Heavenly, heavenly, um, amazing. So I'm going to show you guys how to make 
um, a homemade face serum. So we've all, come on ladies, you've spent a ton of money on beauty products over the years to help with wrinkles and fine lines and just, you know, evening out skin tone. This is the best thing you will ever make and it, it only requires two drops of frankincense and two drops of lavender. It can help smooth the appearance of, of, healthy, yes. looking, of uh, healthy looking skin. Yes, here is um, my little two ounce dropper bottle. So you can get these on Amazon. It just has a glass dropper in it. And um, because I'm doing this one handed, I'm not gonna try and fumble with this, but two drops of frankincense and then two drops of lavender. And then you're gonna fill the bottle with your choice of carrier oil. I would recommend starting with jojoba oil. That's um, a nice carrier oil for the skin. It's more like a wax, so it's not very greasy. And um, it's amazing. So you just put a drop of that um, you know, from this bottle in with your moisturizer and put it on your skin every morning and you will, you will think you have died and gone to heaven. So that is your quick homemade face serum. And that is that. That's frankincense. Next up is Copaiba. Uh, Copaiba is a resin tapped from a tree-like maple syrup in South America and distilled like frankincense. Um, it contains the naturally occurring constituent beta caro Caryophylline. Caryophylline. I can never tell it. it. I'll spell it for you and you can uh, Google it. It's beta, B-E-T-A dash C-A-R-Y O-P-H-Y L-L-E-N-E. So we're getting a lot of questions here on where to get the oils and things like that. So I'm going to follow up with everyone at the end. Um, I will be able to direct message you on Twitter. Um, but if you are curious about the starter kit and want to explore more, please get with the person who referred you. Young Living is a referral-based business. We're going to explain all this at the end, but since we're getting a lot of questions in the Periscope, I just want to address it now. Make sure you get with the person that referred you. You don't just go to youngliving.com and enroll because then you'll be like an orphan and you won't have you'll just be put with somebody and you're going to always be put with somebody and you'd want that person to be someone that you know. Um, so make sure that you, you do that. And if you, if you don't have anyone that's referred you and you want me to be your sponsor, then you can go to homemademommy.net and click on essential oils and you will see where to get info on that. We'll explain again this all at the very end, but a lot of people were asking questions. So I just wanted to make the point. Okay. Um, Beta caryophylline has been extensively studied for its ability to modulate a normal body's response to an irritant. Yes. No, it doesn't really smell that does, strong yeah, at all. It doesn't have much of a smell. No, and, or I, much I of actually, a taste. Yeah, I put um, a drop of Copaiba in my Ninja Red shot every morning. Yes. And I actually put a drop of um, orange in there as well. Yes, yum. So, yeah, I put this in... Um, in my Ninja Red in the afternoon with Stress Away, and it's unbelievable. So if you, if you, there's some other questions on okay. here I just want to address. Okay. So someone's asking what the difference is between Young Living and other companies. I addressed that at the beginning of the scope. So on the replay, you can go and listen to that and understand our farms and our seed to seal and the difference. So just to put that to rest, please watch the beginning of the scope because there was a lot of info in there. Yeah. Uh, the primary benefits of Copaiba promote wellness. Um, can be an important part of a daily health regimen. Um, as I mentioned, I make Jared every morning. Um, and it uh, supports the nervous system, the respiratory system, and the musculoskeletal system. So a lot of benefits to Copaiba. Um, you can put it in your tea. I mean, there's just a lot of different ways to, to have it. And like Lindsay said, it doesn't have a very strong smell to it. Mm -mm. Or flavor. Or no. flavor. Um, but it is distilled um, like frankincense. It's a resin, so it's good stuff. Okay, next up is Thieves. Who out there has heard of Thieves? This is one of Young Living's most popular blends. We did just talk about five single oils, and now we're going to talk about five Young Living blends. Thieves, yes. So if you have ever smelled Thieves, then you have um, smelled something divine because it is amazing. Thieves is really one of our most popular and is inspired by the legend of four 15th century thieves who were actually spice traders and they were covered in these botanicals and, you know, including clove, cinnamon bark, rosemary, lemon, 
and eucalyptus, and they were robbing graves and, and were obviously supporting their immune systems with this amazing blend um, with those aromatics. It wasn't this exact blend, obviously. Um, but thieves can be found in many of Young Living's products, um, including all of our natural cleaners. So now at convention, we just released even more natural cleaners. So we had um, an all-purpose cleaner that is a concentrate that is based on the thieves line. And now we have a dish soap and a laundry cleaner that are all non-toxic, all unbelievable, and smell like this. And they also now have a fruit and veggie wash as well. Um, but in a dish soap. I use thieves um, pretty much daily to support healthy immune function, and I think this is an important point for everyone to understand. You can wait until you fall below what we call the wellness line and get sick to try and make yourself better, or you can use these oils every day to support all of your body systems and just stay well all the time and that's how we use them so if i you know add a drop to my ninja red in the morning or i add a drop to a cup of tea at night i am getting that immune support daily and that's what we want and that is what we need and it, it's better to do that than to try and react be reactive and trying to always catch up with you know that that sick train so um there we go. That is Thieves. So if you love Thieves, I want to get a thumbs up because it's pretty amazing stuff. We love thieves. I have a lot of recipes on my blog, too, that use Thieves. Um, so you can go in and check them out there, including a homemade hand soap. That Next is yes. Panaway. Panaway actually comes with a childproof cap. Which doesn't work anymore on my six-year-old, but she knows right. how to use the yeah, oils. She's, yeah, she's figured out how to open it, but she also, um, she's very well-versed in essential oils, as you can imagine. So we're going to um, make a, make something here with this, right? Okay, so Lindsay will, will make something with it, and I'm going to talk, you know, we'll just kind of work together here. It's a blend of four oils, so it's got wintergreen, clove, helichrysum, and peppermint. Um, and it is a best-selling blend formulated by the founder of Young Living, D. Gary Young. Um, apply topically uh, after exercise. I'll do that after the gym. Occasionally, you know, I'll come back and I'll, and I'll need to use it. Um, if I had a long spin class or something, I'll pop it on a calf or something. So just occasionally I'll, I'll use it where I need it. Um, you can add to V6 vegetable oil complex. Someone's asking why yeah. it has a childproof cap. It's because it has wintergreen in it, and wintergreen smells and tastes kind of like bubble gum, so you don't want a child to be drinking the whole bottle. That's why. Yeah. So I'm going to let Lindsay do the make. Yes, um, we're going to make um, a bath salt here that is a wonderful bath to soak in after a heavy workout. So um, I'm going to put a few drops of, if I don't, I'm going to spill this here, a few drops of pan away. So we get a cup of Epsom salts, see, and we're going to put a few drops of pan away in here, about five drops. And then um, you can also add lavender or other oils that you want to do for your bath, whatever smell you like. And that's it. You just, I put the top on and kind of shake it up. And then just dump it in the bath. Yep, pan away is great in the bath. What a nice way to kind of soak away a heavy workout or just maybe a long, long day. Because it supports the musculoskeletal system and the nervous system. It's amazing. Good stuff. Next up is my favorite oil, I have to say, in this whole kit. The one I use the most, purification. Purification. Show it over there. Purification is... Amazing. I go through so much of this oil. It has six oils in it. Lemongrass, rosemary, lavendin, melaleuca alternifolia or tea tree oil, myrtle, and citronella. So citronella we know is amazing for what? So let's see if anybody can type that in. Um, it has an amazing effect on odors. I put five drops in every laundry load. There you go. Soap nuts. Yes, with my soap nuts, exactly. Um, if y'all don't know what soap nuts are, they're 
I don't know, they're these amazing little, you can look them up on Amazon, just look up soap nets, and, um, and that's how we do our laundry, and I add a little bit of the thieves detergent now, just for some extra power with things that are kind of yicky and mildewy, like what I've cleaned the house with, rags and whatever. Um, but purification, even on my wool dryer balls, is just an amazing way to refresh the entire laundry load and eliminate odors. You can diffuse it um, while you're cooking fish or making tacos, and everything is going to smell amazing. And yes, anything to do with pets um, is great. So I'm going to show you all how to make an easy carpet deodorizer. So just get like a little shaker bottle like this, fill it up with baking soda. Oy, sorry, I'm spilling baking soda everywhere. And put some drops of purification in here. Um, so about 20 drops of purification to a cup of baking soda. And then you can sprinkle this all over, oh my gosh, I'm spilling baking soda all over my floor. Um, you can sprinkle the baking soda on your carpet and then vacuum and you will, it, it's unbelievable. It will be the best thing you've ever smelled. So that's purification. Um, you can also diffuse purification with lemon. I do that pretty much every night. That's kind of my go-to yeah. blend um, unless I'm needing some other kind of emotional support. But purification diffused with lemon is just amazing for a good night's sleep. And that's usually the one that we'll do when we get back from vacation and the house smell there, ha kind yeah, of there haven't been any yeah. oils diffusing in the house and you can smell like how oh, it doesn't smell that great yeah that's usually what will pop on first is just put that in there and let it go and the house smells fresh again yes so um yeah amazing amazing stuff tons Purific of uses tons yeah and purification tons of and lemon just great for a restful night's sleep you'd be surprised try it tonight um next another one of my favorites and this is funny because this i have never um I've never really had issues with food. Um, it's never been an issue for me. Not so, like me. Not like Lindsay. Like my very uh, sad and So tummy. when we discovered Digize, it was something that Lindsay fell Loved. in love with immediately. It was, this was the first oil I bought outside of my starter kit because when I first started with Young Living, this was not in there. And it was the first oil I bought. So if, if anyone who's been with Young Living for a little while, Young Living, anyone who's been with Young Living for a little while um, probably might feel the same way. Digize. It's in the starter kit. So you can buy a starter kit if you want and you'll get it. I have a tough stock now, someone just said. So this oil, it's funny. This, is, this oil is a great example of using oils that you don't like the smell of, that you can either get used to them or sometimes we feel like your body may need them because you don't like it but this guy um i did not like the smell of at all um it's a proprietary unique blend of eight oils okay including tarragon ginger peppermint juniper fennel lemongrass anise and patchouli um, you can add it to a gel capsule there are different there are a few different ways um that you can take it but you can add it to a gel capsule um, you can add two drops of digize and one drop of peppermint to water for a stimulating beverage. Yes. It's our um, after dinner mint. Yeah, it is kind of our after dinner mint. <laughs> and if you think about it, the use of fennel dates back to the ancient Egyptians, right? We all know what fennel is good for. Um, we use it along with every meal with essential zyme um, to support a wellness regimen. And we... To help digest our food. Yeah, I mean, I mean it helps be... digest our food. <laughs> so the funny thing is, with Digize, I didn't like the smell at all. Um, and then what I realized is, the more I used it, the more I liked the smell. And now I just love it. Yeah, we just put a two drops on our tongue after every She'll meal. She'll put two, it's I'll great. put one. Yeah. Which is another indication that not everything works the same for everybody. She does two drops, I only need one drop, and... Let's hold. I gotta discuss some etiquette in the Periscope here. Sorry, webinar folks, but um, the in the Periscope, please do not solicit people in here. That's not what this class is for. Um, anyone who solicits in here with a comment I will be blocked. Thank you. Everyone can go to whoever referred them with Young Living, and there's no need to be soliciting in here. That's not that's not how I run my team, and I don't I don't need people in here like that. Thank you very much. Um, so next is RC and Lindsay will talk about that. Okay, so RC, we're going to actually make um, a chest rub with RC right now. 
What did she say? I'm starting a private broadcast in 15 minutes. Oh, yeah. No, okay. Yeah, we don't need that either. Um, so no soliciting. You will be blocked. Okay. So um, RC, here it is. Here's RC. I'm going to show the webinar folks. RC. RC has amazing oils in it. Let me read them here. It has 10 oils in this blend, including myrtle, eucalyptus globulus, marjoram, pine, eucalyptus radiata, eucalyptus sidiodora, lavender, cypress, black spruce, and peppermint. So of all those oils in there, we know that eucalyptol is pretty amazing for um, breathing easy. So what I do with this is I make a chest rub. Here's what you do. You're going to put, um, I've got a, a empty bottle here. So I save all of my Young Living bottles and I use lemon oil to get the labels off. And I'm just going to put like 10 drops, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, of our C. And then I'm going to add, here, will you open that for me? Can get some squirter in there. I'm going to add some carrier oil. And you can, um, there we go, just squirt the whole thing. That's good. Um, it doesn't matter how much carrier oil you put. I'm, I don't, you know, get scientific like that. If you want to put, you know, whoops, whoops, 10 drops of carrier oil, or if you want to put 50, that's up to you. Depends on how, you know, how you want it to feel on your skin or how you want to breathe it in. So I have a little roller ball here. And these are my favorite roller. Ro oh, here. Let me show them too. So these are my favorite um, roller, what they're called roll-on fitments, and you can buy them from Young Living in packs of 10, and they last forever, and you can reuse them over and over again. Um, I put it on any of the Young Living bottles, and I just use the black cap to turn it on, snap it right on there, and I've got myself an easy chest rub to put on every night. And where I suggest putting this is on your chest and also on the back of your neck, because that is a nice place to put this particular oil, okay? That is RC, pretty unbelievable. It, you can also mix it with um, bath salts as well and you'll have an amazing spa-like smell going on in your bathroom with all that eucalyptus going on. So RC is also really good to use with um, the tinting method that I mentioned earlier. And if you aren't familiar with that, just go back to the replay and you'll be able to hear um, about how to do tinting. So RC, really good for that too. Yes, and awesome to take for a pedicure. Exactly. Yes, this will be in the catch. Okay, next up is the bonus oil, Stress Away. Stress Away, I'm just going to be quite simple about it because um, there's really not a lot to say about this oil except for the fact that we spent two, oil, two hours talking about this oil at Winter Harvest. So I want you all to know there is a lot of science behind this oil. Um, I just can't go into all of it right now. But Stress Away is the oil that you want to take with you when you take three children to the grocery store and you need to get out of there quickly um, without any kind of craziness going on. So, um, you know, we, as I said, we spent many hours learning about this at Winter Harvest. I'm going to tell you what oils are in it, but basically put it on, put it where you can breathe it, and um, you can also put it, um, there's a roll-on you can buy from Young Living as well, and you can put the little roller ball on top of this, um, but it's also a dietary supplement in this bottle, and you can put a drop in your Ningxia Red, and that is what I do in the afternoons. I put a drop of Stress Away and a drop of Copaiba every afternoon. And I put a drop of Stress Away. Oh, this yes. This is my favorite. This is so the guy we, thing. Yeah, this is totally a guy thing. We have a, um, a soda water called Topo Chico. We're in Austin, and it's Topo Chico, and I love it, right? It comes in a bottle, and I will take a swig of Topo Chico just to create some space. Then I will drop a shot of tequila into the Topo Chico, and then I will put a drop of Stress Away into that bottle, and two drops of lime, and it is sublime. Amazing. It's incredible. So great so drink. That's, that's drink. you know. So here's what's in it. So it has copaiba, which we talked about earlier, which kind of eases that feeling of feeling hyped up. Um, it has lime. It supports my ability to remain <laughs> sane. I love that. Yes, it supports my ability to remain sane as well. It has lime, which basically smells like a margarita, and like we just talked about, margaritas are certainly not stressful. It has vanilla essential oil and okatea. Both are really great for when you are reaching for the ice cream when you're stressed out. Ladies, do you do that? Um, 
I used to do that, but I don't anymore. I just put stress away on. Um, cedarwood and lavender, which are both very, very calming and help you to take some deep breaths, which is what we want to do when we're stressed out. Occasional stress, daily stress, not like chronic stress here. We're not talking about that. But uh, super calming. We're, I'm, I was diffusing it. Oh, yeah. oh, oh is yeah. it all done? Uh, oh, there we go. Okay. Um, I actually put stress away and peppermint in my diffuser. Ooh, yeah. Smells amazing. Okay, so Ninja Red. So next up is Ninja Red. This stuff is awesome. As part of your starter kit, you're going to get a couple of packets mm -hmm. of Ninja Red. Yeah, also, thanks for helping me out there. <laughs> yeah, it also, it also comes in a bottle, but these guys will come in your starter kit. Um, this is Young Living Super Fruit Supplement made from wolfberries from the Ningxia province of China and supercharged with Young Living Citrus Essential Oils. Just a one ounce shot of Ninja Red supplies the body with vital antioxidants that provide a natural energy I want to hear who watching in the scope has tried Ninja Red and who loves it. I don't know hear, one. I, I don't know hear, anybody who doesn't like it. Yeah, and I want to hear who's, who's had Ninja Red today. Oh, you yeah. Had Ninja Red today, give us a thumbs up and some hearts. Um, the drink was developed after Gary Young, the founder of Young Living, traveled to the Ninja province of China in search of... He was searching for cultures that had vitality and longevity, right? So that's what he was looking for, and he found it in the Ninja Wolfberry. That's what they were drinking. Yes. All Ninja Red singles are in two-ounce sizes, which make them convenient, easy, and ready to travel. Chill. But it also comes in a, a bottle, yeah, like a wine size bottle, yeah. and that's what we keep in the fridge. So we just use the packets when we're out and about. Um, but you can also throw one of these packets into the freezer and have like a little Ninja Red slushy, slushy. Yeah. which is awesome. Um, some of the, you know, some bullet points for Ninja Red. It, uh, the balanced ingredients make Ninja Red a whole body nutrient infusion for health and wellness support. Um, you don't have to read all. Yeah, of energize, energy. <laughs> it's great for energy. Function. Great for your digestion. There, there There's are, a lot of fiber in here, so it's good for so that. There are so many great uh, properties and uses for Ninja Red that we just find that we'll we'll take it daily, sometimes multiple times daily. So you only need an ounce a day. This is a two ounce packet, but if you've got the bottle. Just start with one ounce a day, and that's just one little shot, and that's all you need to get started with it. But I would say if you are going to commit to doing Ningxia Red, that you should try it for at least 30 days. You need to know, again, you don't want to wait until something's wrong to be healthy. You want to support your body now. And the price per ounce of Ningxia Red is not that much, but it is a supplement. It is not just a drink or whatever. Um, it actually is a supplement, so treat it that way. It's like liquid gold. Oh, Lindsay so, does that. Yes, Lindsay. I make a salad dressing with it too but um, use just a little bit if you want to make a salad dressing but just an ounce a day for 30 days I guarantee you guys are gonna love it yes so um, oh, there, you go. there we go nice. so that is um, I actually gave up coffee after our um, trip to the Idaho farm the Highland yes. Flats farm yes I gave up coffee and haven't looked back I've and drinking Ninja Red Ninja and Nitro, Red and a few Ninja other Nitro things. And just being more healthy. So what are your favorite Ninja Red shots, those watching? Uh, we'll tell you a couple of ours. So a drop of Thieves, Lemon, and Copaiba every day um, in the morning. Or if you want to wake up, you can do Peppermint and Lemon. A digestion support would be Digize and, and Lemon. Um, I love Stress Away and Copaiba. Yeah. My favorite. So um, out of curiosity... How many of you guys said, I could use that one to any one of these oils that we just talked about? I want to know how many, if you'd want to type in the number one, if you thought you could use one of these oils every day. Yes? Just type in the number one. I want to see lots of ones flowing. Well, I would say this. Why yeah. don't type in the number of how many of these oils you think that you could use on a daily basis. We'll go through them again. How many? Digize, Panaway, Lavender, Frankincense, Lemon. Yeah. Stress Away, Thieves, Copaiba. I mean, so once you're comfortable peppermint. with these oils from the starter kit, you'll be ready to use pretty much any of them. Oils can be used to enhance fitness programs, to support the body's natural detoxification and normal detoxification process, to deal with emotional healing and for maintaining and supporting a healthy endocrine system. Pretty much every part of the body can be supported with our essential oils and our supplements. 
So next I want to cover how you can actually get your hands on them. A few of you have been typing in, what do we do now? <laughs> so I'm going to tell you. So um, some of you have already expressed a little bit of interest in sharing these oils with your family and friends. And we have now what's called our Love It, Share It program. So if you haven't heard of this, um, that is because it's new. Um, but if you share these oils with three of your friends in your first month, then you can get your starter kit paid for. And the reason that Young Living is set up as a network marketing company isn't for everybody to be involved in a pyramid scheme, because that's not what we're here to do <laughs> at all. Um, and it's really not that way, because it's you, you do what you make of it. Some people share, some people don't. Most people actually don't. Um, but it's so that you can learn. So it behooves me to teach you how to use these oils and to support you through your entire wellness journey. And I love to do that. I love to help people do that. And Young Living saw that that was what this could achieve. And so that's why they set it up as this kind of company. Because really, if you go into Whole Foods or any other natural health food store, you're not going to get this kind of information and education about essential oils. Because the last I have seen, they don't hold classes every week at the health food store about how to use oils, but we do. Your, so, your person in the apron is not periscoping on how to use um, Young Living Essential Oils. It, it's not happening. They don't, they don't have their face group, no, Facebook groups. Facebook groups and everything else. So it's, it's about the support and the education. So it's important for you to find a sponsor that's going to help you. Um, but if you, you know, are watching right now and you don't know your sponsor, um, go and look in your virtual office. Find out who your upline is and go up to your upline diamond and reach out to them because there is somebody up there. I know all the diamonds of Young Living and they're all willing to help you. So everybody's got amazing support in this company somewhere, even if the person who enrolled world you doesn't do anything with this business at all whatsoever. There is tons of education to take advantage of, and now you can see a lot of it on Periscope, so that's pretty cool. So um, if you are looking to supplement your income, the other reason Young Living set up the company as a network marketing company is that everyone deserves to be healthy and well. And the last I checked, Walgreens doesn't write you a check every month to help pay for your supplements. And most of those supplements aren't even really anything to scream about anyway. So um, that is the part of the company that I find the best. I can order all of the supplements that I need, all of the oils that I need, and I don't have to worry that I need to pay for them because I am getting paid by Young Living to because of all the people I've helped, all the people watching here. Um, so it's pretty amazing. I can help support my own health by helping others, and that's what the key is. So how do you enroll? Basically, you just need to get with the person that referred you and make sure that you get their member number. And when you go to the Young Living website, you'd say sign up as a new member, and you're going to enter in their member number. If you um, do that, you can enroll in two different ways. First, as a retail customer, and the second as a wholesale customer. And I'm going to explain to you the difference right now. Retail customer is pretty straightforward. You're going to pay retail prices. You can order one-off oils and do that as often as you wish on the youngliving.com website. I don't know anyone who really does this, and in my downline, I don't really have many retail customers. Um, but if you want to do that, you totally can. Now, the reason why I don't know that many people do retail is because wholesale with Young Living has really no strings attached. You basically enroll as a wholesale member and you enroll with a starter kit. By the way, you cannot get the starter kit as a retail customer. Um, you enroll with a starter kit. You can pick which diffuser you want. We're showing this one, but there are three different options, actually four, four different options. Yeah, four different options that you can choose from on the Young Living website when you start. And once you get the starter kit, everything that you purchase from then on out is 24% off retail. You don't have to order every month. You don't have to order anything ever again. And that's why most people do it. So there is no requirement or obligation to, to buy or sell oils. I don't have any oils in my home that I sell to other people. I don't, I'm, not, no. I'm not an oil, oil tailor out of my car. I don't, I don't do that. So I don't sell oils. I teach people how to empower themselves to be their own health advocates and to learn and take their own health into their own hands. So um, just as you get a, if you get the wholesale membership and you get this starter kit, you're getting... 11 5 milliliter bottles of oil and you are going to get the diffuser and 
the, in this starter kit, you also get a bunch of samples including Peace and Calming, which is out of stock right now. So I highly recommend you snag those out of there and dump them into a bottle along with some lavender and some carrier oil and you got yourself a sleepy time roll on. Okay, so you've got all these great samples and now you also get these cards here and these sample bottles. So you get 10 of these awesome little sample bottles and you can put a few drops of oil in here, put the top on, and then put them through this card. And the card is where you can put your info. So if you wanna share some thieves with your friends this winter, you can do that. And this card will tell them how to use it. And it's hard to see, but the card tells them how to use it, which is so super easy. And there you go. You have 10 of those bottles and 10 cards to share with friends, or you can use these little bottles to put in your purse. And yes, you can order more of these cards and bottles at younglivinggear.com. So it's an amazing way to share because it's, you know, you're at your house, someone says, oh my God, that thief smells so good, I want some. And you can give them some to try. And you can loan out your diffuser too. I do that a lot in the winter time. You also get um, this little, one of these little roller balls. So you can make one of the blends we talked about. And you get the two, you get the two Ningxia Red packets to try. Oh, sorry, I'm showing all the periscopers, but not the webinar folks. Sorry, I'm sitting closer to this. Um, so as a Young Living Wholesale member, you also have the option to join our Frequent Buyers Club. So if you're looking to get rid of all the toxic stuff in your house, you're getting rid of your toothpaste, you're getting rid of your laundry detergent, which, you know, seventh generation is rated D um, on the Environmental Working Group um, site. So that an F is the worst. So it's really not that great. So, you know, if you're trying to get rid of all of these toxins in your home and replace them with something better, then I highly recommend that you get on our Central Rewards program. And that will allow you to order something every month, a different thing every month. You don't have to order thieves every month or lavender or ninja red. You can pick whatever you want to order every month and you earn points back. So you're, you're already getting 24% off and now you're going to earn points to use on products. So today my dad has been on ER for like 10 months. And so I said, okay, well, let's place your essential rewards order, figure out what we're going to put in there. And then I said, well, you know what? You've got like 400 points right now. So he actually was able to get $200 in free product today because of all those points he'd racked up over 10 months. So I want to hear from the folks watching where you are in ER, whether you're at 10% back, 15% back, or 20% back, and how many points you have right now because it's a pretty awesome program and that's another way that you can get your health supplemented and paid for by this amazing company. So that's Essential Rewards, and your sponsor can help you to get on that as well. So we can go right now um, and enroll and get your sponsor, you know, your friend's member number. If you don't have someone to refer you, we would be happy to sponsor you. You can go to my website and click on the Essential Oils page. Um, you can also, if you want to know more, this was a lot to digest in one night, and you want to get an email a day that tells you more about what we've talked about tonight, then you can text the word, now I'm going to forget it, YLEO101, YLEO101, to the number 33444, and that will put you into my free email series that will recap everything we've talked about tonight in a whole email series. So every day you're going to get an email where you can keep it all and have all that info. And it's also going to link you to um, one of my classes on video so that you'll be able to watch that. Say, say and it one more time. Y L E O one, <clears throat> excuse me, Y L E O one Oh one text that word, no spaces to the number three, three, four, four, four. And that is how you can get started. So thank you everyone for joining. I'm gonna go ahead and stop the webinar and be able to answer any questions that anyone has in the Periscope. Um, again, one last, so the website, you said you can go to the website. The website is www.homemademommy.net and then click, click on, on essential, the essential oils. oils tab. There's a bunch of information. Um, you know, and you, you can like how to buy ready, essential oils. You yeah, can. <laughs> you'll, you'll see it in there. It's, it's That's right. So thank you guys. Thanks everybody. Thank Thanks for you joining. on the webinar.
Bye. Bye, everybody. Stick around in the Periscope if you want to keep chatting. And I may give you an accent or two. <laughs> hey, guys. Thank you. Uh, my scripts are not on the website. Um, that is something I do for my team. So Oily Angels have access to that. Yay. Go 15, you're 15% in month seven. That's right. And you yeah. go to 20% at month 13 on ER. So I'm at 20%, which means that uh, I'm getting back... I'm basically getting back 44% on yeah. everything I order, which is amazing. Yep. Yay. Um, okay, great. Thanks, guys. Who, who in here has a husband that is open to the... Uh, what? I do, do want to kind of end it because oh. then the video, they when they watch it later, then that, it'll end at a good point. Oh, okay. Let's do that. <laughs> we're we're going to... So, and they're not asking a lot of questions, so I think I think we're good. Thank you, everybody, for thank all the confidence. Thank you. Thank you for coming and How am I getting 44%? Because I get 24% off retail as a wholesale member, and then I'm getting 20% back from Essential Rewards and being in Essential Rewards for over a year. So, yay. Yay, yay for all the women here. All right. Thanks, okay. everyone. Thanks, everybody. Have thanks a great joining. night. Thanks for joining us and spending your valuable Wait, time wanna, with us today. Let them, are we going to jump back on and do it? Yeah, we can jump back on if y'all, do y'all want us to jump back on for a Q&A? We'll wait for are a Are you, are you di done? Are you digesting? Yes? Okay. I see one yes. One yes. Yes. No, just one yes. So I don't yeah. think we need to. Oh, yes. Oh, 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 there okay. they go. <laughs> we'll, you know, we'll, we'll jump on and okay, you know, we'll, great. we'll do it for a little while. Okay. okay. So come back. Thanks.